Haven't been on my bike for three weeks. See how this goes. Much better. Uh-oh. Gotta dial those in a little more. Go G out. And once I modify that a bit more, it's gonna push you right out on this trail right here. Switch back number one. Ooh. Oh yeah, no problem. When that dust gets packed in and it's not two inches of moon dust right there, it's gonna be even easier. Switch back number two. Gotta get a little speed because the dirt's soft. Okay, cool. That's good, that works good. Okay, third, final switch back coming up. And we get them all. Get some speed. Oh, piece of cake. These are nice. I wanted to show you guys the unnamed downhill trail. Because I made some minor berm improvements. Might not be able to see it on the camera, but they're getting better. And also, we started cutting in more of this east side perimeter trail, the ESP trail. East side perimeter, yeah, ESP, I like the sound of that. So that's gonna start working its way all the way around. That's gonna be a giant loop. But right now I haven't been doing a lot of trail work because I got the backhoe and I've been working on other things. But I did build that jump line, so that's what this video is gonna be about today. All right, let's check out this uh, unnamed downhill trail. Rough cut, maybe. Someone suggested rough cut for name. And I kinda like that. That berm's got to get huge. Berms take a long time to make, so it's like get the trail done, come back and improve it. All right, here we go. I made a lot of minor berms here. Gonna open that up a little more still. A little berm. Sight line needs to improve there. Gotta open this up, still a little berm. Berm, berm. Flow's really nice me is a trail called Kill Zone. The jump line I've been making it actually comes right into this line, goes down there. That's the one we're going to be making some improvements over time too with a uh, little some booters. But right now it's a super cool like half pipe thing. So you're going to see that again in the video. Brian already released it on one of his videos. Right behind you is the bottom of the jump line right here. I still need to put one more berm right here. But everything up to this point looks really good. We're gonna test it out, see how it rides. Hopefully I won't have to make too many tweaks on this. The unfortunate thing is I'm not a real good jumper, so I will be bringing other people out here to test it out and then we can make our adjustments from there. And everything's so soft, it's gonna make it completely different than from when I actually get it all packed in and everything else. So it's gonna ride completely different. I did spend a lot of time watering it down, so hopefully that helped. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get up there, test it out. So at least we got a pretty decent, easy to climb fire road to get up to the top. So if you guys want to session the jumps, you can. This jump right here just started stacking some dirt. I'll show you real quick where kill zone is going to come out right next to the road 
I just started cutting a little bit of that out. It's gonna bring you right into this jump right here. And then we'll have a little drop right there. And then that sends you into four more jumps. We'll see how many jumps we could put in up higher, but hopefully we'll get at least 10 total jumps on this. Okay, I don't expect a real good ride on this. This is one that suck and this is gonna be scary. This is where the drop's gonna be. Oh, so fluffy. Oh, that's not bad. Sick. Whoa. Okay, I can't, I gotta add this berm. It's coming out in with a ridiculous speed right there. But we still need something to slow you down because you gotta drop into this kill zone. that'll take you out to the road and you could just ride right up that was actually not too bad for my first run let's go do another second run first one really went a lot better than I expected let's hope I could uh, get this even a little bit better I think I'll have these it flows pretty good that's cleared it yes oh That was close. That's all I'm gonna do is the jumps. So you guys could see. You could tell this one, I still have to really get this one wet and packed in. Let's go get my camera, wrap it up. That was sick, I'm really excited. Hope you guys really like this new jump line we added in. It's not even close to being done. Those jumps are pretty close to being done. We still have a lot of elevation above that, so we're gonna add more stuff all the way up to the top of the property. Um, there's the gulch, and that's where the ESP trail, East Side Perimeter Trail is gonna come in. We're gonna loop that sucker all the way down, and it's probably gonna be one of the larger loops on the property. We're gonna make sure it's fine-tuned and really dialed in. Thank you for following along on all the builds and everything we've been doing out here at the property. If you guys wanna make life an adventure, grab a mountain bike, build some jumps, and ride.